Chapter 23, episode 16. Sally bought a postcard in one town made by a girl that took photos of her town and sent the digital photos by the internet to have them printed as postcards, had them delivered by someone passing through, and sold them at the little cafe, a front porch on a family home. That didn't have blueberry pie, but did have some amazing home cooking, where there were no restaurants or hotels. An old woman smiled at them. You like postcard? It's beautiful. My granddaughter make that. Billy knew that, but Sally didn't until she wanted to buy it to write a postcard. In the photo, the owner of the house had a goat with a cowbell around its neck. Is that your goat? Oh yes, she made you butter. She makes good butter. Billy had chosen the lunch visit partly based on the talkative score for the location. Some people preferred quiet. Those people wouldn't come to this location. Most people weren't those people. Billy liked the more talkative. Talkative usually meant they were happy to talk about themselves and their community. No young traveler passed up the talkative location, unless they didn't have coffee. Some travelers looked for the best coffee. Billy didn't care about coffee. He had his priori priorities minimal. He wanted to hear the local story from a local, in whatever language. Billy talked to the granddaughter who had just dropped in to visit. She had seen that one of her photos was just paid for and was curious who bought it. She saw Sally with it at the table. She didn't always run over when she sold a photo, but she lived in a she lived a one minute walk away and eating something at grandma's was always a good idea. She and Billy would likely talk until she had to go home. Another friend co contact for Billy. Sally took a break from watching Billy and the girl to write to the professor. Dear Professor, We are sitting in something like a village at what could be called a guest house, but not really. Billy is talking to the girl that took this photo. The woman in the photo made us lunch. We have been traveling on roads, sometimes trails. We've had great luck hiring drivers on the network ride thing. We eat great food made for us. It's a thing over here. Almost everyone does something and something for someone else. Stay healthy. Love, S. Sally looked up for a mailbox in the middle of nowhere. I take it. Oh. It was put on the bill and Sally was happy to have it on its way. She watched Billy talking with the girl. When the, their next driver came, Sally asked if he had time for a tea or coffee. He did, and they both watched Billy until he realized he was being watched. Sally and the driver both put up their hands, their hands up. Billy smiled. He had a few more things to explain and a few details to question.